So this is how the frame is gonna look. I'm gonna pop that this to give it a little bit more dimension. And she's gonna insert the photo through the top here. Instead of it being down and risking the photo falling out and don't put no tacky tape on there. So I'm gonna flip it upside. She's gonna stick her photo in there. She says she's gonna take photos at the event and uh, give them to give them out as keepsakes for the children. So this is gonna go pop dotted on top. I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, detail. I'm gonna glitter detail a lot of this. So for instance, the ears right here, the outline, the inner part of the ears. I'm gonna outline with glitter, uh, pink glitter. Maybe some of the flowers. I got some purple glitter. I got pink glitter. I have gold glitter. I'm going to gold glitter up the, the horn as well. Uh, so let's get started. I got some pop dots here. And I'm going to add magnets to the back of these. So since she's giving these as keepsakes, the magnets are going to go on back of here. And she, uh, the parents can um, magnet these to the refrigerator um, at home afterwards. So I'm going to go ahead and pop dot since I made since I have three cutouts and these are the two different designs. One has gold ears with the gold horn and the different color flowers and this one has the pink ears inside with the gold horns and different color flowers. Um what else what else what else? So I think that's it. And these were a Google search on the internet and they had the eyelashes you know how the unicorn has the eyes closed it had that with this set but I'm not using the eyes because it'll look funny if they're spread out so since the photos go in here I'm just using the top part but I'm gonna use the eyes and this part for some other stuff I'm designing for her Here I am back with Unicorn. Now, these are stickers. They're made into stickers. So, here's the design. She wanted some with her name. Or, yeah, the she wanted them with her name and her birthday age, which is her seventh birthday. And I just mixed up all the designs. Some are with just a plain unicorn and the rainbow. So all she'll do is when she gets these is peel this paper, which is the clear plastic here, and um, and they're already made into stickers. See, she can stick these to anything. Favorite bo uh, boxes like those popcorn boxes I just showed y'all. That'll be cute. Uh, favorite bags, paper bags, whatever. Next are favorite. Um, cupcakes stick cupcake toppers okay she wanted different designs as well so I mixed them up for her she's gonna get the unicorn horns the unicorn silhouette and the whole unicorn and they're done in gold glitter so I mixed all those up for her oh and there's some with just her name on it hold on let me get that one out it's last one in here and some with her name and I'll just cut those out in circles okay front and back they're all front and back and they're all on sticks 
like that. Okay, there's the toppers. I still need to finish putting those together. Her event got delayed, so I'm, that's why I started on the mini one. So they're going to match the toppers. They're going to match the bags. They're going to match the whole design. So there's one tag design with the unicorn. Uh, one with the horns and the florals and the ears and her name and birthday or birthday seventh birthday one with the rainbow another one with the unicorn face so they're just all mixed up and I think those are the only designs and they have mi uh, mixed matching ribbons Hi everyone, this is Liz from Liz's Party Designs. Tonight I'm working on uh, the final pieces to the Unicorn Party, which are Hershey Kiss labels. I still don't make those into stickers. Um, the Hershey Bar Wrappers, which are these here. Let me show you the design, because I'm going to cut one of these up. So the first design is with the blue glitter trim, then the pink glitter trim, um, hold on just a minute, and I have a few other, few other designs. gold and then the rainbow border the gold down here and then the rainbow glitter border around the top one and then they have her picture like she wanted so there's two different poses for her I try to add the picture here in the middle but it just wasn't wasn't coming together good so I decided to put her picture on the label for the back side of the bar which is still gonna be really really cute Okay, these are the Hershey bar labels. Water labels are these here. And they are printed on the shiny paper. So these are the five designs. And then this one didn't print so well, so I reprinted them with pink color font. And let's see what else. So I'm going to cut up one of the Hershey bar papers, and I'll show you all how those look around the candy. And uh, these are the chip bags. I think I've done this in the last video. But I changed up the colors. So some are blue and some are pink. I decided to go with blue and pink instead. Okay. So I just need to count those at the end and make sure they're all there. All the ones she ordered. Then I'm going to show y'all a cowgirl party theme invitation. I finished those last night and I'm able to print I was able to print one today to get on here to show y'all what it looks like and what the envelopes look like uh, the envelopes I got from Michaels but let me go ahead and show y'all this first before I start jumping on other stuff so I'm gonna do the candy label or the candy bar wrappers first And all she will have to do is oh my gosh, hold on. done with Facebook it's really annoying all right so all I'm gonna do is cut around the and then she'll have to cut these out herself I do not cut them I cut them only if I'm gonna do them as a sample for a video like now 
you just want to go around all the edge. You don't want any white on this on this wrapper. On the chip bag wrapper, that's okay because it has to overlay and, and uh, the white has to be there. So I'm just going to cut around the trim. And she'll do these herself. They're all printed and ready for her to go. And then she'll have to attach them with double-sided tape or tape runner. So I'm going to use tape runner because that's what I have available. I don't have any double-sided tape tonight. Uh, so this is the front of the label. I'm just going to get my Hershey bar. And let me make sure everything's aligned to the front. Like so. And as long as your candy bar is this size, um, I'm not sure what other, maybe the Crunch, Nestle Crunch. There's a lot of different uh, Hershey flavors now, so it doesn't have to be the all milk chocolate. Just as long as it wraps around the bar, you can use it. Okay. So I'm just going to get my folds going here. So there's one fold. And my bar is starting to break because I've used it already several times. Here's the front of the bar. Or the, I'm sorry. Yeah, the front of it is here. And then her picture is going to come out to the back side. I tried putting her picture in the front here, but it just wasn't, um, it wasn't fitting in with the design in the front. So I gave her a border around her picture. And placed it on the back side so that when they're opening the bar they, they're still gonna see her picture or they can save this if, whether they're gonna eat it or not all right and just like that there's the front of the bar um, she'll just have to run some tape here and stick it down and that's it so all the borders are will be different colors well some will be duplicate but all the borders would be the glitter, some some kind of glitter color. So all I did was match this pattern with all her chip bag, her wrappers, her uh, water labels. Then I just got the stars and I just like sprinkled them around like confetti or they look like confetti. And then I added the two unicorn heads personalized with her name and that it's her seventh birthday with her photo. All right, so there's that one. Let me show you. I'm going to leave that right there. Uh, let me show you the water label. Or one water label. I'm just going to cut one out and show you. See how this one matches the pattern? And then I just um, mixed up the colors. Summer solid, summer pattern. It's just going to go all together well with the whole event. And on this water bottle, you do want to take off the white on the top and bottom only. And see how that fits around your wrapper on your on your bottle. Don't cut the side, the water, I'm sorry, the white on the side yet. Until you see how it fits around your water. I'm just going to get a water bottle. Cut off the label. And sometimes the sticky part is good enough to hold the whole label, but then you still have to add your own tape. So it fits around, and there it is. There's the front of the bottle. And then you can set these on the table, snack table, or if you're going to hand them out, then however you're going to do them at your event. And there's the label. And it goes all the way around the bottle. Next is going to be chip bag. I already did the chip bag on another video, but this time... So I'm not going to do a chip bag on this video. I've already done a chip bag. So I just wanted to show you all the design for that one, which is with the blue glitter trim or like a teal, like an aqua blue. And the one with the pink, I already showed that one as well. 
This is the one with the pink. The pink trim. And it's all it's all coordinated together with the patterns and the colors and her name. The chip bag says, Thank you for celebrating with me. You made my birthday magical. Your friend Donnelly. Okay, and then there's more Hershey wrappers. And she'll cut those off herself, like I said. Now I'm going to show you the Hershey Kiss stickers. I'm going to go ahead and open my uh, tape maker, sticker maker. Not tape maker, sticker maker. Jeez. Alright, move this out of the way. And then I'll just place all my circles there. Oops, I dropped one. And these will just all turn into stickers for her. So all she'll have to do is peel them and stick them to her candy. And that's it. I see a lot of uh, Hershey foils that are different colors. You could probably find some at Party City. Instead of buying a whole bag or different bags of different colors, just go to Party City and I think they have different colors that you could choose from. And they're like seven for a dollar or fifteen for a dollar, something like that. And then you can mix up all your colors to match your event. Which is a good idea because you save money and you're not buying all these bags of candy. Just to get twenty five candy or whatever it is that you're gonna use. All right, just really quickly finish these up, and I'm going to show you the cowgirl invitation. And that invitation has a baptism invitation to it. I haven't finished that one yet. I'll probably finish it by the weekend and get those shipped out to her Monday. Hopefully. If I have time to do them. All right. Let's stick those down. Man, this summer has been really slow for me. It's the first time in a while. I don't remember it being this slow during summer. I'm getting orders, but it's really slowed down a lot. Okay, so. It's all, uh, I've already caught up on everything that it's, I'm already, uh, all my orders are shipping out tomorrow. And that this, this, this order is local, so I'll be meeting her in a few, whenever she's ready to get her stuff. Okay, so here's the sticker. I think I have some candies here. They're old. I'm not. They're not going to be eaten. They're just for samples. Okay, these are the Hershey Kisses. Hopefully, I still have the right measurements in my software to where they fit. Yes, they do. And there it is. There's the Hershey Kiss label. And these will look really cute if, um, you know, if you had pink foil, blue foil, purple foil, silver, or gold. They have all those colors at Party City. Um, now that I think about it, I don't think every Party City has them. You have to go, like, to the newer Party Cities that are bigger. And they have the big old aisle of candy. 